he's the one we're focusing on, I think with good reason. Got to keep an eye out for him. Top score in the league with seven so far. Well, Atalanta feeling good about their own game, looking for another victory. Last time out, they won at home against Kievo. Yeah, good, solid 1-0 win and capable of more of the same here. Three changes for Milan. Marco Storari starts in goal. Gabriela Paletta starts alongside Alessio Romagnoli in the heart of defence. Andrea Bertolacci plays with Juraj Kuczka in midfield. Carlos Bacca is the main striker today. This is the 11 that Atalanta are going to field. And it's interesting, they've got three at the back and three up front. It's quite an unusual formation, isn't it? You don't often see it. It's going to be interesting to see how it pans out here. But uh, I think the manager... To take the lead. Fine save he's made there. And he's not let the ball escape his grasp. Kuchka. Now it goes into the wider areas where they've got a winger waiting. Milan are attacking now. That looked very good indeed, but the move has broken down. It's a quick break. And shoots! He scored! Fantastic start. Really quick off the blocks here. And they've given themselves a terrific boost for what lies ahead. Speed, control as well at that pace. It takes a bit of doing, but they got it absolutely right. Well, they enjoyed that, and they've uh, caught the opposition unaware who had committed too many men forward. So the first goal, it's 1-0. Montalivo. He's coming forward with some danger. Tried to tackle here, and he's done that. That's the way to win the ball back. Trying to find a way through here, probing away. Well, they're in there challenging each other. The shot's on! Really powerful shot, and the goalkeeper able to deal with it. Corner. <laughs> and that will clear the danger. Absolutely no trouble for the goalkeeper here to save that shot from distance. So we'll restart with a throw-in. That throw has literally tossed possession away. And that's a foul, and uh, they'll get a free kick for that. For the ref, a decision, and the decision is yellow. I don't think anybody, least of all the player, can have any complaints about that. Keep an eye on the visiting team today, because they're going for a fourth consecutive victory. And they've defended well during that period, and I think they'll have to do that here, away from their own ground. And the cross is in. Well, now they've won the ball back in the middle of the park by intercepting that pass. Tackle here. That will help ease the pressure. Montalivo. It's a turnover in play. <laughs> Trying to stretch the opposition using the wider areas here. Stopped emphatically and just as well. The approach play looked very encouraging. 
Now they've got a chance in this part of the pitch. Milan trying to get into their stride here. Bertolacci. Shot on! And the goalkeeper has done well to stop that one. And there's the interception. Shots on here. And the goalkeeper got a touch to that. Fine save. And it's going to be his throw here. Attacking play from Milan. Looking for an opening with some good control build-up. He's had a go here. And they have scored. And they do lead now by two. And they've worked very hard for this. It should get them across the line at the end of the match. We'll see. Two for him on the day. And two very well taken goals. Restarting at 2 0. Return pass. Could be dangerous. And the verdict on added time is two minutes. Well, they're building steadily here, working away. The keeper might be needed again, he didn't hang on to the ball. And there goes the whistle for half-time, and the scoreline is 2-0. Well, what a player, what a performance in that... F and it's interesting, they've got three at the back and three up. Well, now they're behind. They've got to try and switch things around. And here comes a substitution. Here, the challenge is a good one. Good position. They've worked this attack very well into a quite a dangerous position now. And that will... Oh. Too early, offside. Manager won't be too happy with that. Bonaventura. And that ball belongs to the goalkeeper. Well, he's threaded the pass through neatly. They've coped with it well defensively. They've opened them up here. Oh, that's what we've come to see. That's a brilliant goal. The way they moved the ball about there, Martin, before creating the chance was really good. They picked the right pass every time now. Well, there is a big difference between these two teams, and that goal has meant it's reflected in the scoreline. I think uh, it's going to be a stroll from here on in because they've got a big cushion. Rightly so, well in the lead. Well, they've widened the margin now. 3-0 they lead. Correa. Did well, stuck out a foot and cut off the pass. Coming up on EA Sports for you, the Calcio R fixture. Atalanta will be hosting Cagliari. Yeah, good game, big game. Difficult to call as well. One off, one on for Milan. Now they've got a chance in this part of the pitch. And he's up for the header. And the header doesn't really challenge him. He could have thrown his cap on that one. Poor header. Well, we're two-thirds of the way through the 90 minutes. Half an hour to go. Promising build-up until that challenge. Here's a chance to attack. That'll be a throw. Bonaventura. Crisp defending there.
Bertolacci. Manager thinking for the away side, time for a change. Milan are attacking now. And that's a foul, and uh, they'll get a free kick for that. Just a quick check on the clock, and there are 20 minutes to go. On to the attack now. And shoots! They block. Well, that's a better effort from the goalkeeper. He's not had his best match, but it was a decent stop. Yeah, a bit of a port in a storm, that. It's not been his best display, but that was good. It was an easy save because he was able to plot the path of the ball all the way into his hands. Trying to find a way through here, probing away. And the tackler has been very successful there. He's got possession. And he could get away here. Shot on! Well hit and well saved. Coming up, a corner. There's the ball in. Defender to it first. This might be it. Oh, he had a real go. Well, you can't knock him. He was in the right place at the right time. Just couldn't uh, provide the finishing touch. Bertolacci, Gabriel Paletta. Well, the home team has been outplayed and the home supporters have lost their will to support, I think. Well, haven't they just? You could hear a pin drop here. Seen one or two heading for the exits, they're not impressed. Could be dangerous. Well defended, not just getting across, he thought quickly as well. Carlos Baca. And now the shot. A oh, great work by the keeper. Niang. Well, it wasn't the most powerful header, so it was a very straightforward save. Yeah, it didn't quite get the timing in that header. It was a weak effort. Into the attacking third. Shots on here. At full extension, the goalkeeper makes the save. Still on the attack, and they've got a corner. Got his shot off now. Steered in very classily. Well, it's just a footnote to the match, really. It confirms the win. Yeah, I think the goal scorer would be pleased. Another one for, for his tally late on the match. Well, the referee decides that time is up, and the game has been up for some time, in truth. The final score, 4 -0. It's a quick break, and shoots! AC Milan, nil. Atalanta, four. Let's see what that means for the league tables. At the top of the table remain Inter with 28 points. In second, Genoa with 23 points.